I was uh, seeing the slides and I saw something that uh, uh, it was interesting to me. Uh, what's the difference between uh, something being a tool and something being an author uh, of, of the paper you were talking? Sorry, something being a tool and yeah. or what the, is the other? Author. Author? Yes. Uh, I saw mm -hmm. the slides. Hmm. Uh, I can say like a metaphor. Uh, I used to. Oh, a metaphor. A metaphor. Yes. Okay. Yes. Yes. Uh, I used to listen uh, from some people that they say that, for example, uh, pain is a tool for you to learn. Does that make sense? Yes. Yes. Okay. Yes. So I saw that you said something is not a tool, but it's, it must be an author instead. Yeah. Well, in some ways I think everything is a metaphor <laughs> or can be made into a metaphor. Um, metaphors just give us an analogy um, as a kind of frame for thinking. And I tried to suggest that each metaphor I offered enabled different kinds of thinking to occur, different kinds of questions to be asked. So if you use conversation as a metaphor, you may get something looser, more improvisational. If you use dialogue as a metaphor, you may get something that is more in the Western tradition of philosophical argument, linear argument. So each metaphor makes meaning. And the metaphor of the tool is a metaphor that um, is instrumental. It suggests that you, you take something and you use it for a specific purpose. So I think it diminishes language to speak of language as a tool. Because it is, I mean, it can enable communication, but it can also block communication. So um, the same with technology. Uh, I guess what I wanted to suggest is that we do not use tools. Tools also use us. Tools shape what we can think how we can do. You can do one kind of thing with one kind of tool and something different with another kind of tool. So the design of Facebook, for example, is designed not to be our tool for sharing with our friends. It is designed to deliver us as product to businesses that want to sell us their project. So we may think we are using Facebook as a tool, and I use it myself to share academic information. But while I use it, I am aware of these limitations, that Facebook is not interested in my knowledge exchange with Brazil. Facebook is interested in mining my data and your data. It's interested in making me into a consumer more than a user. Does that help? Thanks.